Amos chapter 9, verse 9. For lo, I will command and I will assist the house of Israel among all nations. Mm -hmm. Among all nations because we have, we've been scattered. All right, that's why you have other nations that look like us, man. All right, Bruce Lee, Cameron Diaz, uh, Vin Diesel, all right, uh, uh, Bobby Caldwell, all right, uh, who else? Uh, uh, just to name a little bit more, you know. Uh, Al Pacino. Yeah, Al Pacino, Robert De Niro. Conor McGregor. <laughs> Conor McGregor, you know what I'm saying? You know, you we could be been... Hey, man, Jake like to do the do, man. We like to fuck, man, all right, to be blunt about it. All right, so when we was in these other lands, we was getting it in, man. All right? We was getting it in. Period, point blank. That's why a lot of the Sicilians, they, uh, I forget what clip that was. was a clip. Basically, they said they got nigger blood in them, all right? Because Jake went down, the Morris went down there, and they had no business like Jake do, man. All right? Like as corn is sifted in a sieve. Yeah, it keeps the good and, and, and uh, throws out the bad, so to speak, man. That's what the Lord is going to do, man, to the house of Israel, all right? Go ahead. Separation. Yep, con. Yeah, yeah. That food right there that everybody can't make it. Exactly. Yet shall not the least grain fall upon the earth. Uh, yet shall not the least grain fall upon the earth. Yep, and that the least of that grain is the last of the elect, so to speak, man. So all, uh, my, all his election is going to make it because they are elect, man. They the elect, all right? And, uh, least any of them shall fall out of my hand, all right? So everybody that's meant to make it is going to make it, man. All the sinners of my people shall die by the sword. Yeah, all the sinners of the Lord people is going to die by the sword, man. All right, and that sword, that could be a gun. It could be an actual sword. All right. Um, it could be the guillotine. You know what I'm saying? However, however way you go out, man. But you're going to die by the sword. All right? Go ahead. Which say... The evil should not overtake nor prevent us. Yeah, which say the evil should not overtake or prevent us, man, because that's how our people think. Well, we in America, you know, I got to get this money. All right, I got to give me two, three jobs. My kids this, my kids that, college fund and 401k and retirement plan, all that shit, man. We ain't got time for that. All right? They go out there had a fucking Super Bowl. Ain't no telling what the fuck can happen. A bomb can drop right at halftime. What shit. Sabbath can land. Huh? Sabbath, yeah, yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? People don't think about that kind of stuff. So they basically they 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 at the end of the day they they proud, all right? Because you believe in a higher power and, and power and respect the higher power, but you don't think that he'll do you nothing, man. You don't think that he got plans. That goes back to the scripture saying that they continue they seen the most high not judging, they continue with things as they work. Because you know, people are used to repetition. You know what I'm saying? Mm. The salvation of Yahweh Bashim Yahshai ain't based off repetition. It's unorthodox. For the white man to go down, like in, on every angle, when when you, when you have to know the white man to do something, and he fuck up and you don't have a backup plan. You know what I'm saying? They come out with these old fucked up ass medicines and shit. We cause fucking uh, uh, a kidney failure and this and that and then you try to sue them and then you can't sue them because some type of bullshit loophole really ultimately to, to continue to feed the, the, uh, the pharmaceutical monsters but they have a backup plan when they fuck up you know um, the black lives matter you know even if, even if, you know they have backup plans but with the most high taking them down any plan that they have the most high gonna shit on it and Jake ain't, ain't, they're not used to that. And that's why you have to have faith and you have to have works, you know? But right now we're talking about faith because Jake is used to what? The same thing over and over, you know? Like, I'm black, he's black, I'm voting for the black guy. I'm black, Egyptian's black, I'm Egyptian. You know, for the record, just because you, you think you, you think you're from Africa don't make you Egyptian, you know? And... Jake just, they're, they're that simple-minded. But that's that's what the most, you know, they can, and, and the crazy thing is, these people could create all kind of magnificent things. 
you know, they could advance the fucking Apple, I, um, the Apple computer to a whole different level, but they still dumbasses, man, because they have no, no fucking morals. And, um, one of the beginnings of a uh, downfall of uh, empire is the, the, the moral, is, it begins with moral decline. And this place is morally suspect of everything. Everything's okay. If you stand up for something, um, you ain't willing to stand up for it directly. You're not willing to be hated for what you believe in. That's why they hate us. Because we, we're like the only, us and the KKK is really the only two people that are willing to be hated for what we believe in, man. You know? They, 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 they'll, they'll tell you, you know what I'm saying? They had a job, you know, KKK, but like, I don't like niggas. You know what I'm saying? You, you be kind of caught by some pride, like, God damn, hold up. You know, same thing with us, man. You know, but you rest you niggas are, are, are lukewarm. You are, you are, you are African nigga, but you trying to build your empire in this crack of shit, man. Who the fuck? Well, what kind of king want to build this empire in another kingdom, man? No, no king. When David was exiled, he came back and got his kingdom. He ain't come back and share it. You know, the scriptures tell you one kingdom is translated to another. They don't merge, and then you have your part. That you know you have your part in the kingdom. That's not possible. Cause who you gonna pay tribute to? You know niggas can't pay tribute to niggas and whites pay tribute to whites. You gonna have to actually separate yourself and create a different law because you got something called the law of the land and you got a standing army, man. Eventually it'd be a civil war, man. You know, Jake just they just used to waking up in the morning. You go to work. You, you gotta take care of your child. Um, you gotta get your dick, you gotta get your pussy. Uh, you gotta get your money. You know, you gotta, you gotta get yourself indulgence, your whatever you into. And then you go back to sleep and continue the same shit. You know, whether it's your luck, it's not worried about all that, man. Okay, we worry about getting out of the kingdom. That is, that is something that ain't never been done since the time of Moses, man. Okay, so it's unorthodox for what we're waiting on. So what we're doing is out the normal. It's, new, it's a new thing, man. It's a new thing that's old, man. And that's really standing stiffly for the name of the Most High, man. That's why you niggas won't be destroyed because we out here grinding, man. We out here doing what we got to do for something that we ain't never seen or history has never seen. Really, history has seen it, but it's so far back that they, they think it's a fictional story. You know? What you, what you, Roman Empire, you know what I'm saying? The, the man that created Rome, I'm pretty sure, man, nobody was backing him. You know, nobody's backing a lot of these people. That's the difference between people that make a difference and people that don't. Is the people that's willing to, to go outside the box to do what they got to do. Man, wicked and righteousness, man. Crazy enough, but that's what you got to do, man. You know, look at Young Thug, man. You know, trying to make other make money. He went outside the box, man. But, you know, the niggas are damn demon, man. But here it is. We're doing the same thing. We're going outside the box, and our goal, you know, like Young Thug is for attention. Lil B, that's for attention. That's their goal, okay? Our goal is for salvation, and we're willing to go outside the box. We're not going to agree with everybody, man, because we for real about what we do, okay? We're not going to be convinced about all the bullshit that you y'all pushing out there, man, because we got a goal, and it's to get the fuck up out of here. What, what's here, man? The fuck is here, man? Here it is. We going. We we gotta go back to our daily lives. We can't. It's a Sabbath tonight. We can't enjoy the Sabbath. You know. You got all the kind of shit going on. Esau wants you to work. You know. Uh, you got this bullshit. You know. Uh, hey, I would have watched it if it was on on a different day. The Super Bowl. You know. But it's still bullshit. But it, it landed on a Sabbath. And this in in our society, we'd have pushed that shit to fucking Monday night, man. It'd have been a Monday night game. You know what I'm saying? But in this society, they going they don't give a fuck about the most high's law. They don't care about the Sabbath, man. Okay? John 4 and 23. But the hour cometh, and now is when the true worshippers shall worship the Father in spirit and in truth. Yeah, the true worshipers. The true worshipers. Not no bullshit. It's not, not you motherfuckers that read a verse in the Bible, go to church. Pay two dollars on tights. You don't even pay ten percent. You pay some five dollars. You get fucking five hundred dollar checks. That's that's fucking five percent, man. 
You know what I'm saying? You're supposed to be paying 50. That ain't 5%. That's fucking 1%, man. God. You know? You niggas putting in little petty ass change. Your ass uh, uh, go home, eat pork. Um, go to the club, commit adultery. And then turn and look at us like we a piece of shit because we carrying ourselves a certain way that you're not used to. You know what I'm saying? That's that's some bullshit. That's the society we in, man. Okay? Uh, John 4 and 23. But the hour cometh, and now is, when the true worshiper shall worship the Father in spirit and in truth. Yeah, so now we're out here. Now, now when I say we, we're talking about the men that's on the highways and byways serving the most high in the spirit and in truth. Like I was talking to somebody earlier, man, and we was talking about um, about the community, man. You know, and look, if, if the elect was really about rebuilding the community, we really could. You know, if, if we was, you know, like I can't say we could because he saw it's not according to the Most High's will. But if the Most High gave us, if he, if he, if he blocked the, he blocked the demons away from us, we could, we, we have the knowledge to build a community, let alone the credentials, man. You got EMPs, you got chefs, you got carpenters. You got uh, nurses, you got all these things within the, the realm of Israel, man. You got professional athletes, you got all kind of things, man, right? And then we can easily go and, 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 and go to fucking some kind of rural area and, and, and build our own community, man. You know, but our people ain't willing to, you know, do that. Of course, they, they are about themselves, man. I'm not, I'm not um, on to that. But what I'm alluding to is that our people... Negro, Latino, Native Americans are all about self and they're trying to build themselves up. And then they claim, oh, it's in the name of the Lord that I got this, man. No, fuck no, Satan. Satan helped you get that and the Lord didn't didn't hinder it, man. That's all that, that's all that is, man. And it's gonna it's gonna be a time that we're gonna reap the benefits of, of losing out in this world, man. You know, which is not a big thing, man. We just don't know, we just so custom, that's all we know. All we know is a car. You know what I'm saying? Before cars, you had horses. You know, so that's all we know that's that makes you a big person. You got a big house. You got this. So that's all we know is that what makes you big. We can't fathom the understanding of the uh, of the uh, salvation of the Most High, man. The Spirit on us to want it, though, man. You know, and when we get it, man, it's gonna be a beautiful.